Hey everybody and welcome back to another exciting episode of Guardians of the Galaxy. Haven't titled this episode yet, but if you were enjoying it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. Hit that little bell notification so you get notified when we upload new episodes. I am still not doing 100%. I apologize for that. But as always, please throw in your headphones, grab your favorite beverage, grab your favorite snack, and let's get to it. <clears throat> and, uh, thanks for the upgrade. All right, let's squeeze our way out of here. So, that thing we set for Uh, you. what thing? I didn't see a thing. Uh, definitely don't want to talk we about no thing. We did a glitch last episode that we've since uh, corrected. It was uh, a little wobbly. Guys, hang back a sec. Ah! Ah! This place is crawling with ugly. Guys, it's not alone down here. Holy crap! This is the most punchable thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Sayonara, space potato. Amazing. Team Rocket! Finally. We couldn't hear you before. Something about the mining ship's been messing up our comms. Yeah, something really ain't right in here. And Quill fell down another hole. Another one. I'm parking the Milano, but Drax is out there searching for you. Maybe you'll find Quill before we do. We're trying to catch up to him. Guys, we really need to get better at the buddy system. She is not my buddy. I will find you, Peter Quill. Describe your surroundings. Uh, old metal, old mining equipment, just old. Noted. You two have any luck? It is not a question of luck. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax? Drax! Hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? Bunch of stuff to mine. What was it? I don't know. Weird QB hunks of rock or metal. Peter Quill, I have located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. That does not narrow my search.
extra hype we need. All right. Pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. It's a possibility. Maybe try something else. Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. It's physically impossible. Drax, think you can half that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! Need some help moving, Drax. You can place it there. Shall be done. I'm not sure why it's still showing the PS4 controls. Remember this moment, should you ever think of crossing me, assassin. I'll remember how slowly you moved. All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, good for you. I am good. It ain't stealing if it's abandoned. We... Oh, fuck. Rocket. Not now, Quill. Rocket. Perhaps he has low... Rocturian shuttle. It wasn't vague. It was... Rushed. It's probably some cute little... Night. Ancient. Lady Hellbender is a renowned warrior. An ideal specimen. Reflect that strength. Like I said, something scary. I disagree. Strength is endearing. My little Camaria and her mother Hovat were two of the strongest people who ever lived. I bet it's something cute. Women dig the cute stuff, right? Yes. All women in the entire universe get weak in the knees when they see something fluffy. Lady Hellbender is an exceptional female. She would desire only the most worthy of pets. You've never seen a baby otter playing with its hands. I cannot refute this. Once we deliver... How so? They say that the mere mention of her name can end the negotiation. You want to turn the Guardians of the Galaxy into an extortion racket? No. I want people to offer us bigger tasks because they fear her wrath. Same thing, Drax.
do you think the monster was drawn to this ship of all places? Sustenance, no doubt. Maybe the ship's engines are still vibrating after all these cycles. Or they draw sustenance from something that is leaking. Radiation could explain our comm problems. Perhaps they're scavenging old food stores for sustenance. Hungry, Drax? Yes. Notice anything weird about this place? You mean besides the comms going dead for no reason? You collided with that column of scrap. You what? I was done. Form of flaming debris. And the comms went out before that. Scary out there, Quill. All right, all right, listen. This isn't our first rodeo, guys. The problem is, if we play it cocky, just one little mistake and they're gonna bring us down. Who's with me? We are Wait a reason, so Peter. this way. How do you know? My senses are fine-tuned to measure even the tiniest vibrations. Really? No, I'm tracking it on my display. The Milano should be right on the other side of this door. It was open when I came through here. Who says I tripped on something? Murder Mom probably closed the door behind me. Excuse me? Eager to meet this monster. Remember, we take it alive. No accidents this time. I don't want a repeat of your mod. Your mod was not an accident. I simply did not agree that the Snark's mercenary deserved to live. He looks like it's still got some juice. Give it a go, Rocket. Watch a genius at work. You are a miracle worker, man. I have to say, that is an immaculate parking job. Thanos never tolerated imperfection. Never been a problem for Quill. Oh, <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah. This is it. Last spot. I can't wait to be out of here. This place feels like it's about to collapse on itself. I cannot wait to meet our monster. I thought you were mostly interested in meeting the buyer. She is a respectable collector. Is it working? Yeah, yeah, don't worry, sunshine. <laughs> Ow! Is it, uh, doing it? What? It appears to be broken. Ain't nothing broke. That's the sound it's supposed to make. What sound? You can't hear that? Hear what? Oh! Our monster. Hey, that thing is fast! Don't let it get behind you. It could be poisonous. That's one less thing to hide behind. Good thinking, Quill. Not a monster. Adorable. More madder than an Asgardian goat. We cannot present this pathetic creature to the monster queen of Sektoff 9. She will laugh at us. Maybe we can use it as bait. I knew those thumpers wouldn't work. What? My thumpers are state of the art. Musclehead's the one who rushed at the first thing that came through the door. My head is not made of muscle. Seeing what I'm seeing. And that is where we will end this episode, folks. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below. As always, I've been your host, Calvin Hale. Be kind to yourselves, be kind to each other. Hydrate and medicate if you have to, and eat some good food, please. I'll see you on the next episode of Guardians of the Galaxy, where hopefully my voice has returned.